So we've probably all seen toilet paper math. 24 mega rolls equals 132 regular rolls, whatever that means. 24 family megas equals 123 regular. 18 mega rolls equals 72 regular rolls. And just so we're clear on the math, 18 family mega equals 90 regular. So I know this sounds like a math problem a teacher who absolutely hates you would give you. There is a reason behind why these are so ambiguous. So these are just marketing ploys that these companies are using, like words like super mega and mega, in order to kind of make you feel better about getting less. Which we absolutely have been, despite the clever use of all these adjectives. So someone went as far to create a toilet paper value calculator. So maybe we can make sense of these hypothetical roll amounts that these companies are putting out after all. What do you guys think?